Hello everyone, on this side Abhishek, welcome back to the ABGAP series. Today we are going to learn how to access the audit vault from GUI and after the installation of the audit vault server there are post installation tasks that we must to do. We must set the username and password of its administrator and auditor and the password of its root and support user. So let's start how we can access the audit vault from GUI. For more detail, you can go to the HTTP doc Oracle EN database, Oracle audit vault database, firewall 20 sign in post installation link. And how to access when we, if you remember, uh, when we install the uh, audit vault, then in last console we get to appliance administrator console at https 192.168.109 it's uh, our ip of avdf at the time of installation we can give this so let's start So first I open the firewall Firefox to access the that is https colon slash slash one nine two one six you can also put the one nine two dot one six eight dot one dot one zero nine we just type enter <coughs> that is a stps here is the oracle audit vault database firewall it's asking for the root password at the time of the install installation we uh, put the root password so we need to put here as same So once the we access the uh, AVDF from GUI and there is a, some post installation there here is a super user super auditor AVDF database encryption and support user and DNS username we need to um, mention all column yes. so here is a super administrator user like Then put the super auditor.
if everything is fine we proceed next <coughs> once the password is set then we need to log in with the username so first uh, i have set up for the super admin as sup admin and uh, Just put a sup admin. Go the sup admin. Yes, so here is the <coughs> and all things are here. We need capture and so the dashboard of the firewall. We can log in with and here is a home disk utilization. How much disk is used? Sheep utilization is there, audit trail is there, agent database firewall is there <coughs> so this is a things we can do from the super admin there is audit trail target group access right if there is any agent is deployed on the audit fault then you're showing here this is a firewall settings there's some settings we need yes uh, the post installation is done then after that we can learn how we can install the agent and how to communicate with the our database between uh, fire uh, audit vault and database target database thank you guys for joining me next video i will show you how to install the agent and communicate with the audit vault and data uh, database